six, five, four, three, two, one! Open for business! Yeah, woo. Well. Oh, Mr. Krabs, Mr. Krabs, can I do it today, huh? Can I, can I do it? I suppose you can have the honor today, lad. <laughs> woo! Seven, eight. <laughs> Freshness, check. Bond, check. Fresh patties. <laughs> check. Oh, silly me. I'm forgetting one more minor detail. <laughs> oh, yeah. Is it getting hot in here? Stop. Or is it just... <laughs> Two Krabby Patties. P.S. SpongeBob, you're an idiot. Love Squidward. Oh, love you too, Squiddy. Two Krabby Patties coming right up. Whoa. Gotcha. This thing is stuck pretty good. I guess this is it. Oh, you really saved me. Splinter! Okay, well, it's been nice knowing you, but you have got to go now. Okay, out uh, we go. Uh, oh, that kind of hurts. Come on. Uh, oh, that really hurts. Oh, barnacles, this hurts! Uh, 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 Cock shell manatees, this is painful! <laughs> Okay, you're tough, you're smart, and you are charming, but you are still no match for me! Look, a bald eagle with a mustache! <laughs> okay, fine, stay, but I hope you like making Krabby Patties. Excuse me, sir, but um, I ordered a couple Krabby Patties a while ago, and uh, I'm wondering when they'll be out. <laughs> Looks like I'm crushing your face. <laughs> so, will they be ready soon? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't move too much. It ruins it. <laughs> ow. 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 You're making this a little bit difficult. Luckily, I am ambidextrous. I hear you, I hear you. Okay, good. Because these two Krabby Patties are ready! SpongeBob. Yes? Can I ask you something? Yes. What's that? What's what? You know. Know what? This. What? This thing here. What thing where? The spatula. Hi to your nose! <laughs> this. <laughs> well, you see, this got stuck up there, so I stacked stuff and I climbed up to reach it. I reached the ground and I got it, but then I fell and I screamed! I was sure I was dead, but then I wasn't, but then I tripped and I got this splinter. Uh, Squidward. Squidward, are you listening at all? I got this really bad splinter, you see, and I couldn't hold the spatula with my hand, so I used my nose. Makes sense now, right? Oh, yeah, that makes perfect sense. You're a half wit who injured himself at work being a nitwit. Ah, good one, Squiddy. Oh, injury. Your brain is injured. Wait a minute. Did you say you got that splinter injury at work? Yeah. Oh, mm, that's not good. I know, it hurts so bad. Yeah, when Mr. Krabs finds out, oh, man. Finds out what? Finds out about this injury. You mean my splinter? He'll be forced to send you home. <laughs> home, but I'm fine. Here, let me take this for you. Why? Hey, wait, I'm fine. It was a good shift while it lasted. While it lasted? What are you doing? <laughs> Why are you... I know it's hard to say goodbye. But, but, but Squidward, 
I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm okay. Look at me. Nothing's wrong. See, see. See, see. Oh, I believe you, SpongeBob, but unfortunately, the rules clearly state that you must be sent home. No, anything but that. Please, Squidward, you can't let this happen. <laughs> you can't let them force me away. Sorry, the rules are the rules. <laughs> Yeah, it'll be pretty quiet around here with Mr. Krabs sending you home early and all. I just hope we'll make it through the whole rest of this day without you here. <laughs> Please, Squidward, don't tell Mr. Krabs. What, me? Tell Mr. Krabs? Oh, no. No, 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 no. Whew! Well, maybe. I don't have to tell Mr. Krabs. Because he already knows. Oh, yeah. Krabs has preternatural instincts when it comes to situations like this. It's almost as if when something's amiss in his restaurant, he can smell it. These quarters smell sad. You're not planning on getting a refill with him, are ya? No, I wasn't. Oh! You're right, Squidward. I need help. Please pick up, please pick up, please pick up. Patrick? No? Yeah? Ah, thank goodness you're there. I got a splinter in my thumb and... Mm -hmm. Oh, I see. Well, I'm pretty booked today. But I think I can fit you in. Thanks, Patrick. No problem. You called the right person, Mr. SpongeBob. Now, let's see where the problem's at. Hmm. Interesting. Um, Patrick? Hmm. Interesting. Patrick? Patrick, this isn't helping. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were a doctor. I'm not. Oh, but I'm sure you can figure it out with your 12 years of med school. Patrick, you didn't go to med school. So? Patrick, I'm sorry. I really need your help. Oh, no, no. It looks like you have things under control. Please, Patrick. I don't want to go home early. <laughs> okay, but we play by my rules, Square Bob. Well, here's your problem. But don't you worry, buddy. We're gonna make it go away. Ah, huh, thanks, Patrick. You're a lifesaver. Ow! There appears to be a little bit of swelling. This garbage compress should help that go down. That doesn't look good. Yeah, but my shift is over. Call me in the morning, if you can still dial the phone. <sighs> What's that? What's what? Behind your back. You mean this? Put your hat on, boy. Show some company pride. Uh, company pride, of course. Uh, SpongeBob? Yes? Have you always had three legs? Yes. Interesting. Well, what's this about a splinter that Squidward's been telling me all about? Ah! All right, boy, let's see it. <laughs> Come on, SpongeBob. It's just a little splinter. I mean, how bad could it be? <laughs> oh, merciful Neptune. Ah, okay. No problem. No problem. For 
second there, I thought I was going to have to pay a workman's compensation. What's workers' compensation? You know, when you get paid for sitting at home. You mean I can get paid while I'm at home? Yeah, what do you think conversation stands for? <laughs> uh, Squidward? I get my conversation now. Oh, sorry, Squidward, your shift ended over two minutes ago. Uh, oh.